Hello everyone, my name is Sierra Schatz and welcome to our channel. Today we are in Sherman Oaks and we are very excited to show you this tour. But first and foremost, we'd love to thank the listing agent, George Alsunian at the agency for allowing us to tour his beautiful listing. So let's go check it out. This spectacular new construction offers upscale living that is centrally located just minutes away from Ventura Boulevard, shops, restaurants, and entertainment. A fun fact about Sherman Oaks is that the opening scene of the 2010 movie A Nightmare on Elm Street was filmed off of the Van Nuys Boulevard at the Springwood Diner. This property has five bedrooms, six and a half bathrooms, over 3,900 square feet of living space, and is on a lot that is over 7,600 square feet. This property is listed for $3,600,000. So before we head inside, I would love to point out this driveway area. You have all the space for kids or for parking for your guests. Over here on this facade of the house right here, you have shiplap all throughout. You have a seating space right here and a unique pendant light above. So let's head inside. And in this home, you have this beautiful white oak flooring all throughout and it matches your window casings and the beams above. This house is also wired for sound, so you have speakers throughout, recessed lighting, two sconces right here on your ship lap wall, and check out this beautiful dark colored fireplace. This is porcelain, so you can maybe come here, hang out, this is one of your hangout areas. We will head right here to your wine space, real quick. You have this glass, and check out this beautiful Venetian plaster wall detail. You also have oak, and this can fit over 40 bottles of wine. So let's come over to your powder room. And you have, on the way to your powder room, you have your garage. So here's that garage shot, there you go. <laughs> and right here you have your mud area. You have the same shiplap and this white oak cabinetry that is throughout the house. And here is your powder room. I also want to point out this toilet is pretty unique. I have never seen a toilet flush right here. We won't push it because it's a little loud, but just a unique touch they decided to put in this house. You also have this beautiful Venetian plaster all throughout this powder room that we saw in the wine space. And you have this book matched porcelain vanity. And book match means they try to match the veining that is throughout this slab. And you also have that slanted drain and your wall mounted faucet. You have an opaque pendant light and we will head out here upstairs and we will get to the other space a little later and I do want to point out definitely watch till the end because we have a cool little pool thing at the end for you so let's head upstairs and here we are in the second story you have an area here to display any artwork and a linear fixed light above and check out the wood detail behind your crystal chandelier. You have that wood detail throughout the house and you also have a crystal chandelier theme in some of the other light fixtures you will see in a second. So let's head over here to your first bedroom. You have a view to your neighborhood through your windows. You also have the chevron wood panel design behind your bed, custom cabinetry, soft closed drawers, and this is an ensuite. And in here you have this blue herringbone towel design on the walls and this light colored towel design all on the floors. You also have black detail on your regular and handheld shower head and your shampoo niche. Somewhat sandy earthy tone countertop color. And I do want to point out that in these modern farmhouses you do see a lot of those light colored neutrals. So let's head out of this bathroom into your next bedroom. And on the way to your next bedroom I'd like to point out that this is your laundry room. And you have somewhat of an ornate tile design on the floor and those same light colored cabinets. And we'll head over to another bedroom. And I would like to point out the chevron wood design on these doors all throughout the house and these unique small details that the developer decided to add but the black and gold handles. So let's head into this bedroom. You have views of the neighborhood and you have this wood panel design behind the bed and a modern candle chandelier above that is attached to your wood beam. Here's your closet space right here. And we'll head into this ensuite bathroom. And in this bathroom, you have a hexagon tile design on the floor and that same beautiful blue herringbone tile on the wall. It's just rotated another way, so it's a little unique from the last bathroom. The same corner vanity with its own unique pendant light. And let's head down this way 
into another bedroom. And in here you have higher ceilings. You have another modern candle chandelier that is attached to your wood beam. And I also want to point out that in each bedroom you have a wood paneling design behind the bed. However, they are all laid in their own unique way. So this bedroom is an ensuite bedroom. And this is a lighter colored bathroom. You have the beautiful light colored natural stone looking towel on the walls with the gold trim. You have your bath, your shampoo niche, and your regular and handheld shower head. You also have the same corner vanity, which is slightly larger in your unique pendant light. And on the floor, you have another hexagon tile design, but those darker tones. So let's head out here. You also have more storage space here. We will head into the primary bedroom area. And on the way, I would like to point out this seating or maybe your second office area. You have built-in shelves here, that beautiful white oak. You can come up here, bring in a clients, and you have a neighborhood view right here, ample amounts of sunlight, and this could be your office workspace. I would also like to point out the matching classy black and gold hardware, plenty of space for books, and here is your primary suite. So let's come over here, and earlier I mentioned that behind each bed there was a unique wall design. So check out this wood accent wall, three-dimensional, and this is something unique I have not seen before. So just a little something special the developer did. You have those same crystal light fixtures with the crystal theme, matches your chandelier, and that is attached to the wood beam above with the wood shiplap design. Straight ahead, you have your walk-in closet. And over here, you have this very large window space with a view to your neighborhood and the pool. And we will pass by this beautiful floor to ceiling gas porcelain fireplace. And the developer used a bunch of beautiful natural stone looking materials all throughout this house. So let's come in here into the primary bathroom and check out the black and white details all throughout this space. You have the matching countertops in front of me with the polished finish. You have a large mirror with the crystal pendant lights. And come in here, you have a rainfall regular and handheld shower head with bench seating. And check out this book matching. You have the veining that starts above and comes all the way through here and ends on the other side of the bathroom. So let's head out of the primary suite into the rest of the tour. So before we head to the main living area, we'll head into this remaining bedroom. You have closet space here, and this is staged as an office. You have your unique wood wall design. And in this bathroom, you have the dark tile on the walls that match your fireplace near the front door, light colored tile on the floor, and the same corner vanity. So let's head out of this office space, past the dining. Check out all the windows right here that let in that abundance of light, and it's a really open feeling. You also have this pretty unique Sputnik light. And here you have some more bar space with those beautiful sand colored countertops, cabinet space right here. And this is your pantry area. You have your panel fridge and freezer. You also have stainless steel appliances all throughout this kitchen. You have your six burner stove right here with your griddle, pot filler, paneled area right here on your vent, all of this cabinet space. And this is a very warm kitchen. There's ample amount of sunlight here. Casement windows with a view to your backyard, your pool, and your pool fountain. And check out the black and gold details that they carried through this kitchen that you have seen throughout this house. You have two sinks, black and gold, and you also have your pennant lights above your waterfall island. Beautiful countertops. I love the choices they have in this house. So let's come over here into your main family area. You have fixed light fixtures. You also have built-in wood shelves. And check out how beautiful this porcelain floor to ceiling fireplaces. So you can come here, maybe grab a book, or open up these sliding glass doors into your backyard. And this backyard is pretty fun. You have a pool, and wait till you see what we have on the side. Let's slide open these glass doors and come out into your backyard. And you have all this artificial grass, and you have this concrete walkway that leads to your basketball court. Now basketball is not my sport. Let's see. Oh, okay, let's see. I'm gonna try one. Okay, <laughs> let me redeem myself. Ah, that's what's up. <laughs> let's head back over here. You have all these ficus trees planted for privacy all around. You also have a fire pit space. And check out this pool. You have a Pebble Tech pool and spa, and you don't have the typical plaster design around the edges. You also have that beautiful natural stone. So let's come 
into your pool house area. And in here you have the dark stone that matches around your pool and the light colors we also saw earlier with the black trim. You have a floating vanity here with quartz countertops. And outside we have, I'll get to this in a second, you have a bar, four stools, maybe fit five, all that natural looking stone. You have stainless steel appliances with a grill, your beverage fridge, and your sink. So let's finish the tour here. This is the veranda on your pool house. It is wired for sound, so you have speakers, you have recessed lights and a ceiling fan to keep you cool when it's warm. So again, I'm Sierra Schatz. That concludes our tour. We appreciate any comments, likes, or subscribes, and we're excited to show you what we have next. Cut it more!